WBTW, Trish Williford, Edward Moody, Chief Meteorologist Frank Johnson, and Sports Director Chris Parks. You're watching number one, News 13 at 6. Welcome back. October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and every year hundreds of thousands of invasive breast cancer will be diagnosed in women. It's the most common cancer among women. Dr. Scott Berry from McLeod Health joins us now to talk more about what diagnosis looks like, the next steps, and what you can do to prevent breast cancer. Dr. Berry, thank you so much for being here again. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah. So, Dr. Berry, when should a woman start getting those mammograms, and how often should a woman get a mammogram? So uh, we recommend starting mammograms at age 40, and, uh, uh, and then it should be done every year um, until as long as a woman is of good health and uh, as long as they're willing to get treated for whatever finding is on the mammogram, uh, we'll do it for mm -hmm. life. Yeah, there's no cutoff. We used to say 70, but really, you know, now we all say that if they come and they want it done, yeah, that will do it for them. So. Good. so definitely go in there and get those. Yes, mammograms. absolutely. They save lives. They How do. is breast cancer then diagnosed? Talk about the diagnosis and yeah. what are some things that go along with that? So most breast cancers are diagnosed on screening mammograms. And uh, what will happen is uh, a woman will get their yearly screening mammogram. And uh, then if there's an abnormality, they'll get called back. And that's sort of when the anxiety starts. And uh, then typically there's additional views and, uh, and then a biopsy will, will be done. Mm -hmm. But surprisingly enough, a large percentage of uh, breast cancers are found by the women themselves. And so for women under the age of 40, certainly 80% are found by the women themselves. So we always, you know, recommend doing self exams. Yeah. Talk about preventative measures. What can some people yeah. start? We, we talk about being healthy, but that really sure. is key. Yeah, it is. And so healthy lifestyle, uh, maintaining a, um, a healthy uh, weight, um, um, low fat diet, exercise, um, alcohol in moderation, uh, quit smoking. Um, having children at an earlier age and breastfeeding also are protective for uh, breast cancer. All right, Dr. Berry, thank you so much. And right now we do have doctors on hand and other medical experts ready to answer your questions. So you can just call that number that's right there on your screen to speak to an expert directly. Trisha Network, we'll send it back to you.